Okay, hi guys. Happy Friday. So this is Mother's Day weekend and I have the day off. And what I'm going to do is just go out, run some errands, do some shopping for our mothers. And that's that. So I applied my eye makeup and I wanted to show you today how I apply my Milk of Magnesia. This is the time of year where I actually get oily. I don't have to use this in the winter time, but I do get oily in my T-zone. So I just use a, a regular cotton circle, cotton round, and I just get a good amount on there. I already have my face moisturized, and I primed it with um, an oil-free primer. This is from Lancome. It's called um, Perfecti Makeup Primer, Smoothing Effect Oil-Free. So I put that down first. And then now I'm just going to apply this right in my T-zone, the top of my cheeks. And that's it. And if you've never heard of this method, then, you know, search. Just put in Milk of Magnesia as a primer on YouTube. And there's hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of videos. And this, this is a new pack of cotton rounds and it sheds, so I don't like that. I could use my finger. I could use a brush. And I just let that dry. And it does dry white. And this just helps to absorb oil throughout the day. And sometimes I do have to blot even still, but it keeps my makeup in place. After I blot, my face looks like I just freshly put my makeup on. And I use these rounds to blot and I don't know what these are called but it's not cotton it's just a little blotting round um, if you really want to know what that is I'll find out and I can tell you just leave a comment below so I'm just making sure I'm gonna have to get, make sure I go back to using my old cotton rounds because this sheds but it's okay so after you let that dry it turns white and that is the area where I get oily right up in here so I just apply my foundation right over. And today I'm using CoverGirl Queen All Day Flawless 3-in-1. And this is in soft copper. And I've had this for quite some time. And I rotate my foundations. Whatever foundation I use, I try to use the same one all week. That doesn't always happen. So I'm using my Real Technique blush, brush. And I just put like three small dabs on here. And this is how I apply my foundation. I just kind of dab it in there first and then I'll start swiping it, buffing it out. And I just use one, one layer. And I always put my foundation on after I finish my eye work because I usually get fallout or if I get fallout from my eye work then I'll just go and clean up all underneath my eye and I don't want to already have my foundation laid down. So that's it. So the magnesia just kind of goes away, it absorbs into the skin, gets buffed into the skin and it'll literally help me stay oil free all through that area. So now all I have to do is just set my um, primer, set my foundation. I may do some under eye work and put some um, concealer underneath my eye. I don't know yet, but I just wanted to show you that is how I use the Milk of Magnesia. Just a little bit goes a long way with that. And if you've never used it, try it out. Um, I never broke out from this and I have sensitive skin. Definitely, I'm an oily, oily girl, so if you don't have oily skin, I mean, there's no point in using this. It works for me. Some people put this on and then their primer. Search YouTube. There's a lots, lots and lots of different um, ways that people use this. This is just how I do it. So now I'm just going to finish up my makeup, finish um, my hair, and I'll show you how this looks, how my face looks in natural sunlight. Okay, guys?
See you Hi later. guys, I'm back. So I'm pretty much done running my errands um, and I ate lunch and my face stayed intact. I didn't have to blot and I forgot my little blotting sponge anyway. I didn't need it. It's about 78 degrees today and it is, actually I don't even think it's that warm, but it's a little humid and I, I haven't had to blot. Now mind you, it's not July heat, which pretty much when it's that hot, I don't even put on foundation. But um, the Milk of Magnesia is a win-win for me. I absolutely love it. And it makes a huge difference. On my lips, I'm wearing... Um, I could not find this in Sephora. It kept being sold out. But I found it online, finally. They sell out a lot. It's called Love. L-U-V-E. That's the name of the color. But it's Kat Von D's Everlasting Liquid Lipstick. I ate lunch and this thing stayed on my lips. Now it dries matte, but I put a gloss on top. It stayed on my lips. Anytime that happens, that's a win-win. So I'm gonna get a couple other, other colors and just keep these in my purse. I absolutely love it. Anyway guys, happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there. I may vlog this weekend. We'll have to see, but I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.